Hey guys, so this week what we're doing is we are looking at the uh, leveling jacks on the Holy Roller. And we're kind of doing some maintenance on that, so I uh, thought I'd uh, I thought I'd give you guys some hip, some hints and some tips and a couple of tricks on what to do with your hydraulic leveling jack system and also what to do if the warning comes on telling you there's a problem. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do in, uh, in servicing the leveling jacks is to grease each zerk fitting that are that's on every single uh, hydraulic jack, and they're at the base of the cylinder, not a uh, base of the cylinder, not of the of the ram. And so what we're going to do is um, get this on here, and we're going to fill this thing up with some grease. And now we'll do that for the other four jacks. Okay, so the next thing you do is you spray the ram with some silicone. And I'm using uh, some CRC heavy duty silicone. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to spray that on the rams of each of the four jacks. And that's all you gotta do. Okay, the last thing that we're gonna do is check the oil in the hydraulic system for the jacks. And so on this 1999-37V Fleetwood Discovery, the reservoir for the hydraulic jacks is back here on the passenger side in the back. And this thing that's right here is the reservoir for the jack. And you'll see a lot of times they'll say power gear on it. Um, it'll have some numbers like this. And so there's a bolt right here up at the top that we need to loosen to then check the level of the fluid. So we're gonna get our crescent wrench on there. Now you can see that this place is in such an awkward place that once we take the, the bolt off, how are you gonna get, the, get, get anything back in there to fill it? And it gets filled with automatic transmission fluid. Okay, so what I do is I use a turkey baster. Awesome thing. All you need to do is open up your transmission fluid, put your turkey baster down into that suck it up in here and then you can slowly put the fluid that you get into your turkey baster and then you can spread it back into there until it is full now a lot of a lot of the manuals will say a quarter of an inch below just fill it up um, uh, if you're driving down the road and you get a beeping sound a lot of times that beeping is tell or a jacks down indication um, and it's beeping at you a lot of times it's beeping at you because this fluid is low um, so you always want to check there. It's a real simple fix um, and obviously as you're doing your maintenance uh, every year It's a great thing to check and just make sure that your levels are topped off So you don't need to worry about it. Even if you have a jack that's not retracting all the way um, It's typically because of low fluid. So I uh, hope that this has helped you take care of your jacks on your class A and uh, Get out there in RV. Get out there and have fun camping with your family. Make sure you make it to church on Sunday <laughs>